Hi, welcome to Fosh Farmhouse Creations. Tonight we're going to make some no-sew fabric carrots. You're going to take some fabric. I got this fat quarter at Walmart in this adorable print of a bunny holding dandelions. Take your fabric and lay it flat and you're going to take one corner of the fabric and cut out a triangle. If you prefer to use a pattern, you can. I like to eyeball my craft, so I did not use a pattern, but if you want to be more precise, go ahead and use a triangle pattern. Once your triangle is cut, lay it flat on your workspace, inside out, and apply hot glue to one end of the triangle. And then you're going to fold it and press it down until it dries. Once your glue has dried, turn your carrot right side out and we're going to fill it with the batting. I got some polyfill from Walmart in the fabric section. When you fill it, make sure you don't fill it all the way to the top. You want to leave room so that way you can gather the remaining fabric on top and twist it shut. To ensure that it remains closed, we're going to wrap some twine around the top and secure it with hot glue. Now for the top of the carrot, we're going to take some twine. I cut a bunch in about a one inch length and you're going to put it through a wooden bead and then secure it to the top of the carrot. Once you have your bead ready, Fold open the top of your carrot and you're going to apply some hot glue and then just set your bead and twine down there in the top. Now for the finishing touch, we're going to add some ribbon around the top. I got this burlap and lace ribbon also at Walmart, but I cut mine in half down the middle so that I could make two out of one strip. And these are the final carrots. They came out so pretty. I love them. They're so cute and shabby chic and they're perfect for Eastern spring decor.